Right, Pete. Yeah. You've been asked to cheat in a game of cards. No. Okay. If someone asks you how do gamblers cheat, what would you say? Um, I don't really know. Well, it's, it's, a lot of the time people say it's sleight of hand and stuff like this. But a lot of the time it's actually about psychology and timing and right. misdirection. So I'll try and show you how it's possible to allow someone else to cheat without them knowing. So if you would just take half the cards for me. Okay? Mm -hmm. And we'll go through a few different shuffles. But when you play cards, you have to always shuffle, cut and deal. It's normal card table parlance to shuffle, cut and deal. Right. There are different variety of styles. Unless you're in a casino, you'll come across these quite casual techniques. Uh, the first is, uh, I mean, just spread through the cards first because we're going to use this for one of the one of the actual moves and just mm -hmm. close up and do that a couple of times. Okay, and we'll use the conveyor belt shuffle. So just spread them and take a few from the middle. Yeah. And just place them on the bottom. Nice and casual. And give the cards a cut. So just pack it down, another packet and a final packet. And just collect them up. And then deal. So that's a shuffle, a cut and a deal. You also come across this type of shuffle. So give these a overhand usually followed by a cut like this. Mm -hmm. You might have someone dealing the cards one-handed. The worst type, or basic type, which can ruin the cards, if you spread them apart like this and then push them in to each other, the cut looks identical to yeah. some extent, and then just blocks of cards down randomly, however you like. Okay, so we're going to try and use a variety of those messy methods. Okay. So just pick the deck up and we'll do this for real this time. Yeah. So spread them out. We'll use the elevator shuffle. But place them on top this time. That's where we'll start from. Okay. And mm -hmm. just give the deck a cut and collect up. Now this is the part we're going to deal to four hands. So uh, just put a block, I don't know, four or five cards down. Do that four times and you should have some left. Yep, mm -hmm. and just deal the rest of the cards on top, whatever, it doesn't matter, as long as you got rid of them all. How well yeah. do you think you've done? Oh no idea. Well, I mean, I've, I've played this before, so that's not too bad. Four of a kind, four kings. Have a look. Good man. Four that's aces. Incredible. Beat me.